Hello everyone and welcome to the fourth Excel C Sharp tutorial. Today we're going to learn how to select and delete a specific sheet. So to start off, let's create a function public void select worksheet and pass it in an integer sheet number. So to select a worksheet, we're just going to use the worksheet that we have above equals workbook dot worksheets and at a specific sheet number. That's it for that. To delete the worksheet, go public void delete worksheet and pass it sheet number as well. Now we should actually test if the sheet number exists at all, but this can be done at later date. For now, let's keep it like this. So to delete a worksheet, we use the workbook worksheets, select the sheet number, and now IntelliSense is going to bug out on us. The function is just delete. And that's it. Beginning to end. So let's test it out. Let's delete these two functions and say x dot select worksheet. And we're going to use the worksheet too. Let's just write down something in it. So write to cell, 0, 0, and this is sheet 2. And now let's delete the first sheet. So delete sheet 1. We're going to use the same, same test file as from the previous tutorial, because it has two sheets and they're all empty. So let's run and see what happens. Oh. Right, 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 right. We actually need to select the file and the sheet we're working with. So it's a test file and sheet number one. And let's run it again. Okay, we're going to replace it, it's done, and let's see what happens. There we go, one sheet, only sheet two, and it says this is sheet two. And that would be all.